Welcome to Top Hat Alaska. Tonight, we'll talk about Pokemon Go. Something that has been taking the nation and people by storm. It's fun. It's everywhere. It's athletic. It's crazy. To me, Pokemon Go is a fun thing to share and talk about friends with. But for most, it's something that causes you to actually go outside and do stuff. As far as most mobile apps go, I'm not a big fan of most mobile apps. They're like fun, whatever, no big deal. But Pokemon Go is one of the ones that I approve of. It actually causes people to go out and do things. And as somebody who's not super, super mobile... It kind of sucks for me, but the idea in itself is awesome. You go out, catch Pokemon. So far, from what I've seen of the Pokemon, they've been Pokemon that are, you know, ones that I know from like 151, the 151, you know, red and blue. I don't know how many Pokemon are out there, but I do know that I've caught like, I've caught like six. Seven different ones, but I've caught a, quite a few of the seven because I live in a small town. But Pokemon Go is an addiction. I I highly recommend that most everybody who plays Pokemon Go actually pay attention to what they're doing because there are a lot of dumb people doing a lot of dumb things playing Pokemon Go. Walking into places that they shouldn't, doing things that they shouldn't, and, you know, it's a game, remember. Just like every game. It's something to entertain you, not something that drives you. It shouldn't be something that causes you to do things that you wouldn't normally do. It should only be things that you would do on a normal. So, remember, like every other game, it's just a game. If you push too far, you've gone too far. Luckily, though, this game has been pretty popular. It's uniting a lot of people that wouldn't you normally unite. And that's something that I'm extremely, extremely hopeful for. A lot of people that normally don't play games, normally don't get hardcore in this stuff, have gotten really, really excited about Pokemon Go. So it gives me hope that maybe we can bridge the gap between gamers and general populace and we can start really uniting ourselves it's one step in a very very tedious you know ladder we have to climb to unite us all as humans one day i hope that we can all just kind of see eye to eye whether we play pokemon go or you know we're jocks or we're you know druggies or whatever whatever classification you want to give yourself i hope that one day we can all kind of see eye to eye and become friends because ultimately we're all humans and there's no reason for us to hate each other i see hate on the internet all the time out of proportion hate hate for police hate for black lives matter hate for white people Hey, for anyone, this is bullshit. Because with hate, we only perpetuate more hate. Well, if we can all just love each other, have fun, and enjoy enjoy each other, we have a lot of fun. I think Pokemon's a really good step in that cause. Because we can just go out, have fun. The divides, the... Oh, like, I ran into people that I really don't think they would normally be like, Hey, what's up, dude? That were... I was like, hey, Pokemon Go? You play some Pokemon? They were, you know, open to me. A lot more friendly. And I'm hoping that maybe games in general can open a perspective, a conversation between gaps that normally exist so let's see 
Let's see. Pokemon Go is the gateway to more things that affect tons of people and get tons of people excited about something that normally wouldn't. It bridges an age gap. It also bridges a gap between cultures. And for that I'm proud. I'm proud to be a gamer. Knowing that a game on a phone can cause so many people to rally amongst each other and be excited about a common theme. We can rally and acknowledge each other as people. Other players. So much more than what our stereotypes would acknowledge us for. And just be happy. Because you know what? The world's a pretty shitty place a lot of the time. Until we unite. And we ignore the bullshit in between us. And we just smile and have fun. So here's to enjoying life. One drunk guy signing off. A drunken rap about Pokemon Go.